has two minutes, 30 seconds. So black on the floor, yellow on the floor, red outside. Why are you here and not practicing on the court? Ugh, minor issue. I had to have a toenail removal. I'll be back next week. Next week? Next week. All yeah. right, waiting for your debut with the team. Debut scrimmage. with the scrimmage, huh? Yeah. yeah. Second scrimmage in a row I'm missing. I reckon I'll be back next week, so I'll play next Friday. God's right. willing. What have you been doing so far to recover? Uh, just a lot of mobility, stretching and stuff, you know, just working on being mobile, staying mobile, and a lot of weight room, just trying to get my swole on. Don't, don't get too slow, you'll be slow. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, Martin is good with that stuff, so he's keeping me right. All keeping right, me right, right, making sure I'm ready for when I return. Yeah, all right, thank you, man. Yeah, you're welcome, bud. Okay, guys. Uh, uh, practice, uh, especially in execution-wise, was not only better than yesterday, but it was very good, very good. It's been a long while since we didn't have this kind of practice, this kind of execution. You competed, you fought, you got spirit, and you executed. Very good practice. Congratulations for that. Let's get this out of the way. <laughs> you know, in Venezuela, when I used to do this, coaching staff used to help me. <laughs> but here, nobody helps. Yeah. Let's pray. Let's pray. Coach, um, how is the progress improvement of the team so far? Uh, I believe we are doing a good job. Uh, we still uh, don't have all the pieces yet. Uh, we are not with the full roster, but we're on our way. Uh, our idea is to be ready for January 14. That's our main target. So everything we are doing right now is uh, towards that goal. And hopefully all these scrimmages games allows the guys to, you know, uh, feel confident within the system that we run. Okay, it's been like almost two weeks with Lester, Jordan and Tabario. How are they blending in with the team? They're very experienced kind of players. They've been all over the place. They have had great coaches. Uh, obviously, the quality of the execution of what we do has increased. And right now, what we are trying to do is uh, all the local players getting to know them and Tavario, Lesser, and Jordan getting to know each other too. And we have one more import coming soon. What, what, what is your expectation from him? I have big expectation from him. He's a great player. Uh, he's proven uh, that he is a winner. He's played in many different countries. I coached against him many times. He has national team experience, World Cup experience and he will fill a spot on the roster that is very important for us. Uh, we really need him. All right, thank you, coach. You working, bro? Yeah. Hard or hardly working? 
Say what? You working hard or hardly working? A little both. bit of both. A little bit of both. <laughs> oh, my God. So, are you ready to be a cheerleader again today? Yes, sir. Whatever the team needs me, I'm here to do my job, baby. Just make sure you say their names right. Yeah, hopefully that I won't confuse Chris and uh, Furman. <laughs> That is, it's not hard to differentiate. And, uh, hey, we're still getting acclimated, okay? We're still getting acclimated. I'll get them. I'll get them all okay. soon. Okay, so far, who's your favorite guy on the team? Uh, i say Rio and Chris. Yeah? Rio and Chris, good guys. They're all good guys, but Rio and Chris my guys right now. All right. One thing very important we need to do better than last game. First of all, turnovers. I'm not saying we are not going to have turnovers because it's impossible, but we need to reduce the amount of turnovers. And second of all, rebounds. Stop giving up opportunities on the defensive rebound. Okay? Let's go. Let's pray. Ball off. About a million I keep in the trend, resilient the energy off. My image is garbage and deep in the pot. I got pieces of people I love. R.I.P. on me. Melanin on me, my cheekbone is made of the soil, it's my wild walk. Some people show me my go figure my enemy, make enemy scoff. Admit it, your energy off. My frequency killer, you soft. I show people love, they act like they are brother. The switch when they see me, I'm lost. I tell the truth when I talk. Just wanna be me. I used to sleep in the car. Till my girl when it crashes in car. Now I got a crib down the street. Young niggas made it so far. I never lose what I'm on. But now I'm cool being me. But I need you to match what I'm on. Cause you wanna play games when I want. Women looking at me, she think I'm needing her on. I'm doing me for me, hon. I never needed no one. I never beat around sharks. They saying you are what you eat. But she wanted me to be lunch. Got body from the turf, my hair in the breeze. The fair con, keep the peace. I look out for me. Like we take a shot here, everybody watching, they run the floor. They score five points in a row like this. You don't go to the rebound, you don't make defensive transition, you do neither. They score easy. Then, on defense, one on one, man, again. One on one, drive, foul, drive, foul, offensive rebounds. Come on, guys, the problem is not the offense, we are taking good shots. We are just missing, but if we miss and we don't come back, they will score easy points. We take a shot, if you don't go to the rebound, get back, especially perimeter players, okay? Let's go. We still haven't scored the ball from outside, and we already have 53. So offense is not the, the thing here. The thing is they have 47 points. First, defensive transition. I'm telling you guys, if you don't go to the offensive rebound, get back. 
especially with the foreign players, which are the guys who score the most. And one more thing, no overhelp. Every time we overhelped, they are making us pay. So we can do, we must do a better job there. Because at the end, when we made stops, we started to push the tempo and scoring on fast break. Okay, so this is also very important, so we can create fast break opportunities. Then, in offense, in offense, we are not scoring, but it's good shots. Keep shooting. I tell you one million times this. If it is a good shot, keep shooting. I don't care you miss. I care about what we do then on defense to make stops, okay? Let's focus on that, let's go. Baby girl love my bop and I like me too. No roof on my top and my big seat through. Hanging on the pen, don't stop, they ain't gon' feed you. I've been all on my grind, so why I need you? Baby girl love my bop and I like me too. No roof on my top and my big seat through. Guys, last four points, easy baskets. Fast break, layup. We have two fouls to give. Either we turn the ball over or it's almost a turnover. No more turnovers, give good passes. Pay attention because 92 is trying to take over the game. Either thing they do, this guy is not guarding the inbounder. If they can put the ball inside, we go to the trap right away. We make one trap, try to steal the ball. Go aggressive on a trap if the ball goes inside. If they can come off, off the trap, we have to foul, okay? One trap to try to steal the ball, first deny, and then we try to get the ball. If they go full court, still this guy doesn't guard this man. If they can get the ball inside, trap and then foul. Okay, let's go. Defense, three, one, two, three. Defense. We need to learn from this. We need to learn from this. I'm not pointing fingers. But we need to be smarter. Smarter. 93 points, we are not going anywhere like this. Anywhere. Now you have three days off. See you again on Tuesday. Let's pray. Dua game, dua kesempatan menjaga pemain-pemain asing dengan level yang tinggi apa yang bisa dipelajarin apa yang sudah Pace pelajarin selama ini dua game terakhir 
sebenarnya saya juga ingin dapat ya defensive player of the year itu juga salah satu ini sih keinginan saya nanti di season depan nah dari sparring sparring ini lawan tim tim lain nah pas ada pemain asing ya itu belajar dari situ jaga pemain asing gimana mereka kan juga jago jago kan ketika pace diarahkan coach gitu buat pace jaga pemain asing ini perasaannya gimana sangat senang sih dikasih kepercayaan untuk menjaga jagoan lah istilahnya dari tim sebelah kan jadi nggak ada rasa takut takut malah makin semangat menjadi motivasi sih sebenarnya oke okay. mantap pace semangat uh, you watch it on the sidelines how do you think the game went Overall, I think we played a decent game. I mean, it's basketball. It's always going to be a lot of ups and downs. You know, it's a game of runs, but I think we played a, a decent game. It's a lot to take away from the day, a lot we can still learn from and grow as a team. Coach mentioned our defense today was not at the level uh, we were supposed to be. In what way do you think that is? I, I think, man, we came out hard. We hit a few shots early, and, uh, you know, we got relaxed on defense, defensively and offensively, honestly. So, We got relaxed on defense. Guys wasn't physical with the opponents, and uh, you know they made us pay. They, they have a really, they have really good players over there, and that they made us pay. So we have to just have to learn. We have to be aggressive on defense and offense. Uh, the full 40 minutes. All right. Last question. After seeing two games, how excited are you to help out the team and play? Man, you know, I'm excited, man. I'm just here to do whatever the team need me to do. However, I can contribute and help the team win. That's what I'm here to do. I'm, you know, I'm looking forward to playing with these guys, getting on the court with these guys. All right. Thank you. Bro. Thank you.